And greetings, everyone. Oops. Welcome to Twitchy Tuesday with Simoru. That's me. And uh, I'm going ahead and running Shaw, my fighter monk. Trying to get that epic completionist. We are, I don't know what, 60% way through towards level 23 at the moment. Just look at the LFMs. I don't see anything I really want to do. So I'll just start with some warm up. Do some party crashers. Get 
right in the mode. So this morning was the morning that the people came out to paint our house numbers on our curbs and uh, I got up, make sure the check was taped to the door as instructed and fed the animals and took the dog out and stuff and I went back to bed and I was woken up a while later by the dog just going crazy because the guy came to pick that up. I didn't hear him, but evidently he was yelling to the other guy, and the dog just went crazy. Not a pleasant way to wake up. So if I'm a little off today, it's probably why. Because I was deep asleep when the dog woke me up. Hope everyone enjoyed our Friday show where we did ins the entire Inspired Quarter from Kenneth. That was interesting. In the Demon's Den is always an interesting quest to do. I actually did that again with my uh, guild static group on Sunday, and it went a little bit better than it did on Friday. Mostly because we had six people, so there's from the beginning we knew we could split up. And I didn't end up being the kiter for once, which is nice. Watched Gravisers earlier doing the pit, which was amusing. So the plan to start with is to grind some bit here on Shaw, and then I may switch characters or servers or something after that, but. At first, I'm just get the Shaw some XP. I really haven't been playing too much outside of my static group kind of days, and of course Tuesdays, which ends up being four times a week. But the other days, I barely touch the game. I kind of log in and do my dice rolls and maybe do some gear inventory management or something, but I don't do much else. Speaking of gear, I didn't put that link 
into the chat, but uh, LSD 37 is starting the thought work and some initial coding on a gear planner. The thread for that's in the forums. If there's anything you want to see from a gear planner, I would definitely go chime in on that. I made a maybe somewhat long reply on that thread, although a lot of that was just showing the format that I would prefer to have the output be in for uh, forum posts. But also some of my ideas, because I was thinking about doing this, a similar thing. I was going to make it a web page and then just have it output either text or BB code. But hey, if somebody's else going to do it, that means it might actually get done. So I still have my character tracker thing that's in progress. I really want to use one of the newer JavaScript frameworks with it. I just haven't gotten around to it yet. Hello, Gemini. How is it going? Hope you're doing well this evening. So I was finally in the mood to watch something yesterday, and I ended up watching some Black Butler, which, while I enjoyed the dark and combat-y and kind of horror kind of pieces of it, I really just disliked the slapstick comedy in between. But I watched most of, I don't know, four or five episodes maybe. The Jack the River one was interesting in the way it ended. That's the kind of stuff I wanted from that, not the uh, rest of it. So funny thing, I was on the PS4 looking for something to do, and I... Oh, I'll open the Funimation app and see what's in there. So I said, like, oh, look, Black Butler, let's look, start at that. I've heard of it. Yeah, it's supposed to be good. Let's try it. And there were, oh, so many commercials. There was like three or four commercials before the opening, and then another three or four or five commercials after the opening, and then another bunch of commercials, another bunch of commercials, another bunch of commercials. And I was like, oh, this is why I don't watch stuff anymore. Funnily enough, I stopped watching it because I got annoyed by the commercials. I went over to Netflix to find something else to watch, and lo and behold, it was on Netflix, subbed, and no commercials. So I could have been without commercials the entire time. I watched another couple episodes that way and enjoyed it much better. Didn't really see anything else anime-wise that I wanted to look at, so I ended up watching some Arrow instead. Which I fast-forwarded through a lot of character development and plot and got to the more interesting villains and fight scenes and encounters and stuff. I was almost going to break out some DVDs. That's how much I wanted to watch something. I haven't done that in a long time. Come on, run, run, run. No, not you. Him. No, and Netflix, I, I, there might be a site, external site that might show you. Um, Netflix's search is kind of wonky because you can search for something and then if it isn't there, it'll still pop stuff up saying, oh, well, it doesn't tell you that it doesn't actually have what you're looking for, but it shows up, shows up this other stuff when you're in the app anyway. Um, on the site, you'll get a better selection than you will unfortunately on a device because of stupid licensing restrictions where you can stream it on a PC but not on a console for some stupid reason. I don't understand that.
And there was an OK selection under the automate category. I was just looking through it just to see what was there. And uh, there seemed to be several choices. I just didn't find them interesting at the moment. I was looking. Yeah, I've heard that the melee warlocks are the new thing, but I don't. I don't know. I have my one melee with my warlock set at group, and it's kind of underwhelming the way I have it built right now. It works, but everybody else is just killing it before I really get to them. So, you know. Not really doing that much. Although I have both of the uh, bursts now, and that helps. When I do actually get close to something, I can pretty much just burst it down if I can't melee it fast enough. I believe I have a great sword on that one. I don't remember what I had. No, I think I was going great club or mall. Go ahead and sing before I forget to do that. The current hotness seems to be the Warlock Paladin Favored Soul builds, which I've seen several of. I don't know if that's exactly what Skunk's doing. No, he was doing the PDK one, I think. That was, he was doing a PDK melee build. So a rat that's been kind of uh, wheezing got an x-ray the other day and actually has some sort of growth on his lung or near his lung or something, which is why he can't breathe very well. So we're not exactly sure what it is, whether it's some sort of malignant tumor or if it's just an abscess or what, but uh, we have to give him medicine that he doesn't like twice a day. And it's a lot of it. It's a full like mil is it full milliliter, is it? Hello, Vorpal Snack. How's it going? Hope you're doing well this evening. Let's see what else. Um, I've been playing Fallout Shelter a lot. As in, I have three different vaults that I'm overseeing. Mm. Which one was that? Ah, uh, yeah. I think I looked at that one at one point when I was looking at the loot, thinking that'd be fun to have, and then didn't really pay any more attention after it, because I don't run Temple, basically. Huh. Yeah, that'd be fun. So that's what I was thinking of the, the um, item or gear planner is to be able to say, hey, I want to use this at this level and actually have it there. Then you can go back and refer to, oh yeah, that's right, at this level I need to go run that quest a couple times and try to get one of those or maybe look in the auction house for something or whatever it is, you know, have a plan for all that gear, or at least 
a plan, if not a plan and some options, depending on what you actually get. Now, I'm not saying every level, but, you know, hey, at this level, you want to probably switch to this. That might switch the rest of your gear around, so maybe every four levels or so, you're going to be looking, well, every four levels after, like, at, like, 12 plus, probably. Before then, you usually don't need to worry about gear that much. Sleeping dogs lie. Is that true, dog? Do you lie when you sleep? I know you dream. Show me the love, please show me the love. This is my last epic life for completionist. Please show me the love. I would really like to get the drop that I want here. He'll do no such thing, silence or something like that. Nothing of the kind, that's what it is. Your service terminated. Survey says no love. I'm so disappointed. I'm so very, very disappointed. So that weekend uh, XP bonus was awesome, wasn't it? It was fun to get uh, grouped up and get more XP just because you're grouped together. Really enjoyed that. Yeah, see, I um, I know people enjoy that sort of thing and it has its place, but I, I'm the kind of game player that no matter what game I play, I pretty much skip the plot and turn off the music and most of the sound, usually. So, yeah. I mean, I'm glad there's a plot, but it doesn't mean I'm going to pay attention to it. Yeah, I think the group bonus is a good thing. I think the raid bonus will be a good thing. That'll be fun. Just, uh, Makes a lot of sense. Because then, if you really want to get that stuff. <laughs> exactly. I, Gemini, I figured that's what would happen. I was going to say, really. Really thought that might happen, that people would change 
and wait for people at least to enter the quests and such a lot more often just to keep, make sure they got that bonus. Probably see a lot more people uh, AFKing too. And people not caring as much because, hey, you know, as long as they're in the quest, you get that bonus. But really, can you a static group where you already have it full anyway? So you're guaranteed the 50% bonus. Is it still active? I didn't realize. I thought it it ended uh, Monday. I said I haven't been playing much outside of my normal windows. I've barely been booting the game and getting dice rolls otherwise. Favor runners were a problem. Javur, which greetings and welcome. Hope you're doing well this evening. Hello, lag. You're making it a little difficult to get around that corner. Yeah, you can join. I don't care. I just may be switching up later. I don't know how long I'm actually playing Shaw. I see. Well, yeah, that'd be annoying. Then they kill your XP bonus because they're too high level. I understand. In that case, the group leader should be not letting them in. Well, I admit I wasn't really checking levels when I was doing group uh, the other day. So we may not have got as much XP as we could have, but it didn't really matter. That particular group we were just being casual about. Completely missed. I noticed there were not very many raids being run, or at least LFMs for them. I noticed that was a big difference, and I thought there was a lot more groups in general just up. 
on the LFM panel. So I was off doing other stuff part of the weekend and really wasn't playing, which is unfortunate because it would have been a good time to get some XP in at all level ranges probably because I saw quite a bunch, quite a few LFMs at different levels. So I could have probably brought any of my characters on and gotten a couple levels out of it. But haven't been playing much on weekends because that's when the SO is off, so we spend time together and animals and stuff. Rather than playing. We do play on Sundays with our static group, but other than that rest of the weekends more for other stuff. Alright, make sure I got both sides because I want my eight percent. I'm not gonna get the ten percent of course, but at least I get my eight percent. Horrible lag in the jump here today. <laughs> there we go. Finally. And again, I'm on Thalonis. If anybody else wants to join, I'm in Epics right now, but can switch to lower Heroics at some point if that's what you got. Let me know. Right there, I thought I got that skip. New Chronicles out if you haven't seen it. Weekend bonus is going to be uh, Challenge Awards, I think. I posted it in the initial chat while I was setting up.
What a jerk. Just about to open that chest. Hey, Arnians. Hope you're doing well this evening. Welcome. And voices. Good, good, glad to hear it. I am doing okay. I have relatives visiting next week, so need to finish more of the house cleaning and stuff. Mowed the lawn today. Well, at least half of it. And, uh, yeah. Oh, let's go house. Okay, let's do Vaughn 3 next. Somewhat tempted by that. E. E. Belly the Beast, but meh. Need to make a 30% striding ring with feather fall. That'd be the ideal combination, so I wouldn't have to switch back to this one. And why are my hoppers not working again? That's so annoying. Yeah, I think once I hit 23, I might switch characters. Play something else for a change. I mean, I like Shaw and all, but... No, it's just... Fate Singer seems to be the best of the Arcanes to get the past lives in. I haven't seen too much in either Magister or Draconic that interests me. Whereas Fate Singer has some utility, at least. This will be my, this is my 12th epic life, so. After this, I can figure out what to do. I can stop running in off destinies if I feel like it, I guess. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I've got the double strike three times. I've got the fast healing three times. Power over life and death three times. And enchant weapon twice. So This is definitely my last of my completionist, epic completionist lives. Oh, that's nice. Held me right in the trap. Jerk.
Hey, City, how's it going? Hope you're doing well this evening. Welcome. Yeah. I mean, I did the... I've tried both the... <clears throat> Epic reincarnation into off destinies and to level them, and the sitting at cap to level the off destinies. I much prefer the sitting at cap to level off destinies. But then for the grinding, it doesn't matter as much. Once you've already got the destiny max, then it's not as big a deal. Nice to sit at cat for a while and get some gear and grind some stuff that's just a lot easier when you have all that power and gear, even if you're in an off destiny at that point. It's not as big a deal as if you have to start back at 20 when an off destiny, then you're losing power in both to do that. Yep. It's not a bad plan. I just, as I said, I don't do the hero reincarnates, so. It'd be a little expensive to do plus 20 hearts every time I needed to do that. But, you know, maybe I will start hero reincarnating now. Because, yeah. Now that I've got all these epic past lives, I've got a lot more power that I can take back into heroics. I'll probably be doing iconics anyway. Get those knocked out. I may try going into the Blade Forge melee warlock build. I may try that. I almost always go for that collectible, I don't know why. A lot of people just skip it. I figure, hey, if you're up there killing those guys already, might as well stop in and see what's up. Nope. I'm going to have three paladin levels and probably have five favorite soul level. I'm going to do that build that people seem to enjoy. It's a new hotness. It's three levels of paladin, one favorite soul, and then the rest warlock. I've seen a couple people playing it. And the saves. Do not forget the saves. You know, I'm not sure. I haven't investigated the build fully. I just know I've seen people playing it. 
I was guessing light spell power, but I wasn't sure if that was there's anything else to it. And greetings and welcome, Saint Janbla. I hope you're doing well this evening. But yeah, I was going to start theory crafting that up and seeing what it was all about. Obviously, I'd go two handed great axe. I know paladins go shields a lot, but I'm all set up to be great axe. I've got great axes, I've got great axes, and I've got more, even more great axes. So it makes sense to keep in that line, I think, a bit. Nobody up here? Nobody up here. I thought I looked for that one. I missed it. That's two. Where's the third one? Uh, there it is. It's over here. Open says me. Bit laggy, almost fell. I like, well. The arena part of Vaughn 1 is kind of uh Vaughn 2 is interesting. It's got a lot of different stuff. Vaughn 3 is this one, which is good. And I actually like Vaughn 4 as well. Um, some parts about it I don't like, but in general I like, I like it. It's a pretty great series. And then Vaughn 5 is awesome. Vaughn 6 is okay. Yeah, I obviously have a lot invested in great axes, so it just makes sense to use great axes. Bobby Peanut, greetings, welcome. Hope you're doing well this evening. Um, we're talking about a three paladin, one favored soul, and then the rest warlock. This can be challenging if the group doesn't split nicely and work together like they're supposed to. You can have some issues then. I've wiped this a couple times on six and have been locked out a couple times on six. But for the most part, if you get through five, six usually isn't that big of a deal. That's my main concern about going to a heroic reincarnation is that I want to be able to use my great axes. Hey, there's my level. Cool. Yeah, I find ice to be the hardest part, which is why I don't mind going to either of the other ones. I die a lot nice. Those polar rays just hurt. Thanks. 
Yeah, that polar ray though. All right. I'm going to take this level real quick and then probably switch characters. Not really sure what I want to run. Titan, I didn't check. What level are you? Or if anybody else wants to play on Faunus, what level do you want to play at? Figure something out. Hello, baby Jesus 2000. Greetings and welcome. Hope you're doing well this evening. Capped, okay. So I can pick somebody. I, you know, I haven't played VAR in a while. All right, Gemini. Have a good evening. See you. Watch Gemini tomorrow on this channel, by the way. Get rid of some junk I don't need. Haggle hat on this time, I remember. All right. You must watch Gemini tomorrow on this channel. <sighs> this is a boring level, isn't it? Yep, it's just a level. Nothing exciting about it. Being at work isn't an excuse. You've got a phone. Your work has a bathroom. You've got a phone. You can make it work. Just make sure you have, you know, really spicy Mexican or Thai or something for lunch. They'll understand. All right. Let me switch characters. By the way, this is me. I'm available other places than this channel. I have been streaming Fridays on my own channel. I archive most of my streams up to my YouTube. And, you know, communicate sometimes on Twitter and I'm on Steam all the time and other stuff. And why am I not logging out yet, even though I said log out? You can watch me. my status change to all the clear games I play. Woohoo! And all the games I run just for chart, just for cards. And occasionally something I actually play. All right, let's switch to switch to um, no I think I might feel like playing my sorcerer instead we'll do that sorcerer away I don't remember the last time I played my sorcerer. I may have forgotten how to sorcerer. Sorcerer. Nice bit of lag there, though. Are there any groups up to join Caught in the Web or Mark of Death? No, thank you.
Titan, where'd you go? Okay, so what am I doing at the moment? Oh, I'm trying to cap Shadow Dancer so I can move on. That is what I am doing. I'm capping Shadow Dancer so I can move on. Okay, got it. Um, let's see, what is new and different and exciting that we can do that I don't usually do or something, I don't know. Yeah, I think you want to run Titan. Okay, we'll do house case stuff then. We'll run Vaughn 3 again. Hey. Or you want to start, just do Vaughn 1 through 4 again. Haha. <laughs> because I know you love 4. We'll just do Vaughn 1. Something slightly different. Alright, how do I do things here? Uh, sheesh, some blur, some jump, some greater heroism, some st Okay. Never mind about that then. We can do this though. That and that. Yeah, I guess we could do Wiz King after Vaughn 3. Or 4 if you actually want to do 4. And displacement. I'm ready to go. Let's see, where are my SLAs? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Kind of remembering how to do this. I need to turn to the right channel. There we go. Two is a lot of fun. Four, I have a lot of fun with most of it, but it can be a little much. Don't forget to aggro the guy over here. Very dangerous Indy, you go first. Seriously? All right, fine. Let's do dot. A bit of that, a little bit of that, a little bit of that. Some of that over there. There we go. It's not like they're um, much majigger. The thing from Orchard, I can't remember the top of my head, that kills your everything divine. Uh, intercession. It's not like you're getting interceded or anything. You're just anti-magicked. Just back up cast some uh, light rays or something, you'll be fine. Or grab your shield, wade in, and just hit him. Yes, quells are horrible. 
Hate them. I hate them on any class. I hate intercession just because you can't see anything. Really? Uh, I don't know. Well, I got bluff. Bluff. Ha! I think it's the first time I've actually gotten through without uh, having to fight. Okay. I'll take it. That's why all my characters want the uh, anti quell orchard gear, just because the anti quell orchard gear. I don't care if there's something better in that slot. If I'm running orchard, I want that gear. I don't want to be quelled at all. Ah, missed. Mm-hmm. Which reminds me, I think I have some extra orchard gear I need to distribute to one of my other characters. Sitting in the shared bank at the moment. Are we going to orchard last, last week? I think so. Oops, let's not get hung up in the doorway. That's, that would be silly. What do I have for heals? Looks like just pots on. Is that 11? Yeah, it's 11. It's not an ideal situation, that's for sure. Definitely going to shrine. Thank you. Yeah, I'd like to get a mythic anything, but... I don't run that stuff enough to really worry about it. Alright. Get some buffs on. We'll be ready to go. Oh, they're out already. Hello, friends. How are y'all this evening? Die for me, would you? Thank you. Let's 
see, I think Greeter has some hit points wore off already. Let's make sure I'm displaced for next round. What else can I do? Do I have a dancing ball? It's a single target one. Do I have a ball? I can't remember. Mind fog, heat death. Do, 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 do. Let's see if I can preemptively get some of these guys going. That's it. Stay around the fire. It's a lovely fire. Really, it's lovely. You should stay in it. And die. Of course. And that dying part is not optional. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, get through his announcement so I can get this firewall up. Oops. Thought I had acid cloud somewhere. Ah, uh, yes, it's on nine. Acid rain, that's what it is. Woot woot. Get my guard tower key. Get the chest over here. Get the chest of the guard tower. And then pick up the axe. I could actually get to the chest because there's a corpse on hay, seal of the necklace of the Azure Prophecy. How about that? Not what I wanted at all. of 980. Well, I guess Wiz King would probably put me at Cap Shadow Dancer if we want to just go directly there. Heart Seeds. That's right, I'm at Cap. I can get Heart Seeds. That's awesome. Uh, 
student bags popping where my IRC window is. Actually, wait a minute. Do I have? Yeah. Step back in here a second, Titan. Where'd it go? There it is. Yeah, heart seeds give you the hearts for epic reincarnation. You get them when you're at cap. So they're handy to get. That's another reason to stay at cap if you're grinding all your destinies is that you get the heart seeds while you're doing it. Let's turn some auto run on while I check this message. I just got on my phone. Oh God. <laughs> I don't want to do that. So basically, if you run 21 quests, not the same quests in the same day, is that how it works? I think it is. Once a day, you get the heart seeds drop. You get two heart seeds per quest. The first time you run them every day. So you run 21 quests, and there you go. You've got a reincarnation. It's kind of handy. Hopefully this won't go too bad. Of course, since you're at cap, you're wasting XP by having to run, but if you're grinding out your destinies, it's not a big deal. Gives you a reason to sit there and grind out destinies. Fireballs on eight, acid rains on nine, disintegrates on ten. Okay. Have to get used to that. Again, it's been a while since I played this character. That, that, that. Yeah, we should be ready to go. Hello boys and girls, time to die. Why are you not dead yet? You're taking an awfully long time to die. Caster too, maybe that's why. Sorry, they should be dying faster than they are. Be may need some more spell power. Oh, let's just do this. Touch of idiocy. I'm not that kind of caster, dude. It's not going to be very effective. Okay.
Interesting, no traps on that one. That means we're going to have the blade traps here. Maybe not. How good am I guessing today? Ooh, made it past the first room. And second room as well. It's not gonna do much to miss it. Nope, I need to use that. And that. And that. What do you want, dog? I see a dog. What do you want? That's not what I wanted to do. That's not fun. Hey, Mari, how's it going? Hope you're doing well, Sibney. Good to see you. Welcome. Nice. Vacation rocks. Get over here and die. There we go. That was not my additional firewall. Um, disintegrate, maybe? Oh, that's not disintegrate. That's disintegrate. Yeah. So disintegrate's what I use at clay golems. Got it. You're still alive, you're a jerk bag. Immune to acid. That was a weak disintegrate. So fire it is then. Say, don't I have heal scrolls somewhere? Because this is getting ridiculous. There we go. Uh, 
let's make sure I'm up on my stuff before I do this. Let's see. Oh, I got unlucky. Texture me for off. Well, fine. We're just going to integrate your butt then. Oh, he doesn't like that. He doesn't like that. Am I going to have to disagree? Oh, I don't have enough hit point or spell points to disintegrate him the whole way. Mummy Rock came in at kind of a bad time. My charisma's going down. Yeah, I hate pulling Ryum. It sucks. All right, Titan, I'm going to sit here and let you do the rest. Hey, Gaming Fang 099, how's it going? Welcome. Hope you're doing well this evening. The plus to having Ryum is that you get to pike while everybody else finishes the other towers. So, you know. There's that. Huh, yeah, the group bonus is still going. Wow. That's cool. Oh, and Titan lost connection. See, he saw me saying I want to pike, and he said, no, I'm going to pike. I'll show you how to pike. In DC, that's how you pike. I guess I can Deodore back, go Shrine, rebuff, and do Tower 3, but eh. How far did Titan even get? He's not showing on the map. He lost connection. Oh, look, somebody's doing spies. Do I have potions for remove curse and disease? Because those would be handy. Oh, hey, my heart seeds. I better put those in a bag. Ouch. I de seed. Huh. I de seed from Twitch chat. Weird. So let's not remove curse. No remove curse there. I don't appear to have any remove curses. Well, key wrap. That sucks, ours. I don't know what you want, dog. We just did that thing you want to do a little bit ago, just before I started streaming. You shouldn't have to go again for another little bit yet. All right, we'll go after this, okay? Looks like we're gonna be taking a break after we finish this quest to uh, take the dog out. He's insisting that we do that. So. I guess we must, because I don't want to clean up a mess later. That's for sure. Well, since he hasn't finished his tower, I will go ahead and detour. If I have detour somewhere, don't I? Yeah, there it is. We will detour back, shrine up, and do tower three. And then run back to Tower 1 to get the Flectory.
You're gonna have to be patient. I have to do this whole other tower, dog. It's gonna be a minute. Go lay down and wait. I see you, dog. Go lay down and wait, okay? Go lay down and wait. I'll be with you in a moment. Not happening right now. Am I speaking Swahili? Not yet. It will be a bit before I get to where I can do the thing you want to do. All right, Mari. Night. See ya. Wait, wait a minute. You're on vacation. You should be able to stay up however long you want. Now I want you to just die like a good, huge clay man being thing. Ugly, by the way. Now, where is Tower 3? This is the one where I have to walk, don't I? <laughs> yeah. Hey. No saving from Disintegrate. That's rude. Imagine the rudeness of that dude. Saving from my Disintegrate. Making me cast double disintegrates on him. They are so rude. Oh, hey, Travis, what's up? Dog, go lay down. He's got Hamie going on there. Throw enough spells at them and they just die. Rather quickly, in fact. Can I guess right again? So far, so far. Ooh, just made it. Those are fire methods. We need to use this other thing on them. There we go. There might be danger nearby. They're spinning blades, but there just might be danger. You're not sure after seeing the spinning blades. Dog, I understand that you need to do something. You can get out of my face. We will do that thing. Just be wait, okay? Wait. I'm getting there. I am getting there. You just wait. Lay down and wait. Don't be jerks. You jerks. Um, excuse me. How did you av completely avoid my disintegrate? Jerk. All these jerks. It's like this place is just completely filled with jerks. The seals are if you want to insta-kill the one of the genies, the one with its name on it. You can do that if you have the seal. You usually don't bother with them, but if you want to do that, you can. 
All right, all you jerks. If you're going to come bug me, you got to come through the uh, passage of just die already. All right. Let's go ahead and get my heal scrolls in now before we do this. He's immune to acid as well. Yeah, you could run it through Tower 1 Titan and be ready to grab the Flactory. I'm already in Tower 3. I cleared my Tower, which is Tower 1. It had the Whiz King in it. I'm now in Tower 3. So you really should go to Tower one and grab the phylactery after I kill things here. There we go. That's a good boy. Laying down by the door like you're supposed to be. Just hold that pose for another five minutes or so and then we'll be we'll be good. I'm gonna go ahead and heal up again. Even though this isn't right, I mean, it's not going to be as big of a deal. There we go. I have a ring of feather fall somewhere, don't I? I think it's this one. Nope. It wasn't a ring, after all. Okay, anytime I'm going to up the phylactery, that would be good. So we get the extra 10% bonus because there's two of us, which is a nice addition, although I'm already capped, so I don't even need the XP, which is sad. I'm sad, dog. I'm so sad. You know, I can't tell on the map where you are or what you're doing, so I don't know. You look like you're in Tower 3, but they all wrap around, so it's hard to tell. You know what, I don't really need the loot anyway. See, I've got fast feet, don't I? I rolled a two and save, so I only fail my mummy rot rolls on a one, and I keep failing them. That's cool. Eventually, up here somewhere, I will find... There we go. Hey, Queen, how's it going? Alright, voices got it.
why do you have to keep popping under my flow window? It's annoying. You're just in time for a break. Uh, doing okay. Let's see. What do I have? Oh, yeah. Not much is going to beat that. I'll just take some heart seeds because heart seeds are always useful. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to teleport back to market. And end up by the spirit binder so I can get my mummy rot taken care of before I take a break. Ice cream soda? Mmm, that sounds good. Well, I finished off the bag of mint cream Oreos earlier. There are only five left. And I also had a strawberry smoothie ice pop or whatever they called popsicle thing. Ailments, curse, ailments, disease. There we go. Still haven't tried the brownie batter ones. Esso hasn't cracked them open yet. Okay. I will take a short break to walk the dog, and uh, we will be back after that. Probably about 10 minutes, so if you want to get up, stretch your legs, refill your drink, get a snack, go contemplate deep meanings of life, or whatever, you got about 10 minutes. See you on the other side. <laughs> 